What is good, Wavy Navy? It's Woo, and we finna get Wavy. You dig? Real, yo, I had to shine for me. Okay, my money fuck you all. Fuck, we talking big bucks. Yo, I gotta dump a truck full of expensive stuff. Yeah. My game the fuck you. Let me turn this up just a little bit so y'all can see me a little bit better. There we go. So, you guys, I am back with some more content. Y'all already know. I posted like 16 videos since last week, so, and probably today it's going to be up to like 21. I don't know. I've been going ham on the videos recently, so I'm really excited about it. You already know. I am doing a video about how I'm going to speak this into existence because I keep having like low-key dreams slash visions. I don't know. Got that That's So Raven stuff going on. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, but I keep having this this thought. Okay, we're gonna say call it a thought. We keep I keep having this thought of me meeting DDG. Like I don't understand like why I keep thinking about it and why and how DDG has become a big part of my life and he don't even know it. That's the weird thing. As y'all know, and if y'all don't know, DDG is my favorite YouTuber. Like, I watch his stuff all the time. Like, I can watch his videos all day, right? It's very entertaining to me, and I can just sit there and watch him for hours, right? DDG is very big on YouTube. I'm pretty sure he's probably, like, the, one of the biggest YouTubers on the YouTube platform. He has multiple channels, hundreds of thousands of subscribers on all of them. I think one of them has two million, maybe more than one. I don't know. But I know he has a very, very big fan base. Um... I started watching him like four years ago. He is, he's a YouTuber that has put a lot of people on the map with the YouTube, you know, platform, his family, his friends. He's like, like really helped a lot of people get to where they needed to be on YouTube to where they don't have to work that nine to five. They don't have to get up and work for somebody else. They're doing it themselves. It's an at-home job, right? He's done that and he's just recently, um, starting only fans it ain't no freaky stuff bro so don't even don't even try to don't even try to put that on me bro i'm not weird bro it's not it's none of that it's none of that he's literally telling people what to do in order to you know help yourself get to that monetization faster and make as much money as you possibly can on youtube and a lot of people saying it's fake but it's really motivated me and made me really want to like i've been going ham on the youtube stuff like i said Probably gonna post like four or five videos today. I've been doing that for like the past two weeks now Yeah, he's really motivated me to uh, just really grind on this YouTube platform but and Another thing about DDG. He is also is mainstream. I'm talking about he's a mainstream artist like rapper He can do that and man can low-key sing too, bro. Like he's just so lit to me and that's like what I'm trying to be on on my YouTube channel. Like I want to have that DDG status. That's what I want. That's how I picture my lifestyle being is like DDG. Even before I started watching DDG, my lifestyle wanted well, I wanted my lifestyle to be like DDG's. Like how how it is now, that's how I want it. Like it's just lit to me. And he just posts so many videos, bro. Like Dude posted like seven videos in a day. And I'm just like, bruh, I can do that too, bro. Like, I'm posting the videos. But that's besides the point. Besides the point. Let me tell y'all why I keep thinking or and I'm trying to manifest this, right? So, it's like I have two different thoughts about how I'm going to meet DDG. It's two different thoughts. One of them is um, I take a trip to Cali, right? I'm in LA. And... We, I'm just vlogging, you know, I probably, I feel like I was on a vacation, like, it kind of feel like a dream almost, I don't know, but it's like, I'm on a vacation with my, uh, with Mercedes, right, I'm on a vacation with Mercedes, and we're walking it down, like, this street, it's a whole bunch of stores, palm trees, and, like, I don't know, if y'all see that video where he went out with the German girl, if y'all see that video, um, Y'all see, like, the area, like, what it looks like. That's what I picture. Like, he was on, a, like, an electronic skateboard or something. That's what I picture, right? So, I picture that I'm walking down, and then I see... Y'all saw me scratching my ear? That, that. <coughs> that right there be, be lit, bro. 
it be lit it's like you scratching your throat i don't know it don't even be your ear it be like right here i don't know it'd be great i'm walking down and i pass ddg i'm like oh i'm like oh bro that's that's ddg so i'm like i'm vlogging right and i'm like bro that's dd that's ddg bro so i'm like hey he turned around he like what's up I'm like what's up bro i'm vlogging too you know i'm not gonna be nervous i ain't gonna be scared i'm not gonna be none of that i'm gonna be real you know what's up bro i'm gonna be real cool about it real chill about it like you you my friend i'm gonna talk to him like you my friend bro because it's like i feel like we friends what bro what are you talking about man do I sound like a weird fan, bro? Listen, bro, I'm not a weird fan. It's just I look up to that man. Like, that's what it is. I look up to that man, bro. Stop it. Get some help. I look at him as like a mentor, basically, okay? I'm not weird, okay, DDG? I'm not weird, DDG. Please don't think I'm weird. But, like, yeah, I see him, and I, like, I end up being in his video a little bit. You know, he put, like, a little segment of me in his video when, he, when I walked past him at the freaking shopping center, wherever the freak we was at, like, and I'm speaking to him. I got him in my video, so it's like, dang, bro, I got DDG in my video. My channel's finna blow up, man. Finna blow up. I'm probably gonna cry when I get in the car, though. I'm like, oh, my gosh, bro, I really met DDG, bro. Like, that's crazy. Like, what if I look crazy on his camera, though? But, like, that's one, right? Then, I got another thought where it's like, okay, VidCon. If y'all don't know what VidCon is, it's like a big convention for a whole bunch of YouTubers to go learn new things, meet some of their favorite YouTubers, this, that, and the third, right? I really want to go. I haven't been yet, but... I'm probably not gonna go until DDG is there, most likely. But um, yeah, I'm at VidCon with Mercedes again. We're walking through the convention and whatnot, and I look up and I see Dub. That's who I see first. First, I'm like, oh, that's Dub. There go Woo Wop. Is that Woo Wop? Is that Von and Ari? Boom. There go DDG, and I'm just like. Oh, what? That's DDG. And I'm vlogging again. Like, bro, like, bro, that's DDG right there. I'm gonna zoom up. Like, bro, that's DDG. No cap, bro. No, no capital, bro. No capital. That's DDG. It'd be like, he gonna be like, hey, what's up with you? I like her. I like her. She funny, bro. She funny. Now you probably like, bro, she funny, brother. Yeah, yeah, you funny. You funny. I like, I like, I like your personality. And it's cheese, like I don't know, bro. DDG be having me weak, but that's how I see it, and I just see it like from that point forward, me finally meet meeting the person that I feel like is a mentor to me and that motivates me to do YouTube. I just feel like from that point forward, my channel is just going to take off. I really feel like it's just gonna take off because it's like I don't know, went from watching this man. Before even I decided to do YouTube, went from watching him, him being the reason why I decided to do YouTube, I do the YouTube, and then I keep falling off of it, I'm not really interested, and then he posts something, and I'm like, bruh, he say, he say one thing, post the content, and I'm out here like going crazy over the content, like I'm posting so much, so it's like this man really motivates me, and I feel like one day I'm going to meet DDG. Even if it's not the ways that like I imagine, I feel like I'm going to work my way up to where I'm at least in the same vicinity as DDG. I, I don't know. I'm speaking into it into existence, you guys. I'm speaking it into existence. I am going to meet DDG. I'm going to meet Daryl. Going to meet Daryl. Not gonna call him Moo. Because he don't like when people call him move because we not family. I don't know that man like that. So I just wanted I just wanna put this video out there, put it out in the atmosphere, and I'm claiming it. I'm grabbing it. It's mine. I'm gonna meet DDG, bro. No cap. I'm gonna meet DDG. That's gonna be that's something that's gonna happen for me. Like I'ma meet DDG. So 
yeah, I guess that's it for this video. Make sure y'all claim that for me too, though. Y'all gotta make sure y'all claim it for me. Bring that into my life. Manifest it into my life. Give me all the good vibes. Give me all the good vibes. I need all of it. But yeah, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Stay litty, stay waving, it's woo waving, and I am out.